How do you get people to communicate with one another and not hurt each other, both emotionally or physically? Because small things can really hurt. For example, a mousetrap. And then I hold it in the palm of my hand like this. And I asked my volunteer, would you be willing to take your pinky, matter of fact, the end of your pinky, right on the end, so it really hurts, and put it on the bait tray of the trap and let the, you know, set it off? Would you be willing to do that? Now, teenagers, they go, yeah, especially teenage boys. Yeah, I'll do it. And sure enough, the entire high school will go, yeah, do it. Uh, which, that's a whole nother program. <laughs> I won't get into right now. But adults will normally say, nah, I'm good. And then what I'll say is, how about if, um, are you willing to set the trap off with me, me holding it and you setting it off, but I don't want to get hurt and I don't want you to get hurt. And I go, okay, yeah, I'd be willing to do that. And so we get to the point where the person puts their hand over it. We say one, two, three.